Hello YouTube! Today I want to talk about Tumblr and specifically night vlogging. Now, night vlogging is referred to when Tumblr gets weird. Now every website gets that w weird part of it where it just gets plain creepy. But Tumblr hits an all new high when it comes to being weird and posting stuff, when it, especially when it hits about 11 o'clock at night. So to get a proper definition of night vlogging, I'm going to go to the Urban Dictionary. Night vlogging begins usually around 11pm and finishes in the early morning. Bloggers on Tumblr will blog strange things, sometimes deep yet completely messed up, sometimes utterly meaningless. Sometimes gifts of stupid things and sometimes bloggers will even go as far as questioning the existence of humanity in those few strange hours. I went through Tumblr looking for a collection of these things and I found two main posts. One called Night Blogging a Collection and one called Tumblr Gets Deep at 3am. This is usually the time where people should be going to bed but decide to post something profound in their mind that they think is philosophical and the world is just going to be amazed by their discovery. So let's begin reading. Do dogs even note their dogs? Oh, freaking hell. What if eyeballs had butts but we just didn't know because they're behind our skull? What if a tree cried when you started eating their fruit because the fruit is actually their babies? So every time that we eat an apple or something, we're eating a baby tree. Oh, oh no. Somebody's posted after this, we're eating their ovaries. Nope. What if nipples were actually painted there by the government to track your every move? What? What if your belly button screamed when you covered it with a shirt because it's scared of the dark? <coughs> okay, I'm putting the laptop somewhere. What if, what if stars were all stealing lights and we're all being lied to? <laughs> what? what if ice cream lit you back? There's a video on YouTube that does this. I'll send the link in the doobly-doo. Yeah. <laughs> okay, ice cubes are effing badass because, I mean, they float around in their own blood. When you're... When you have your period, do you take, just take a shower and stand there in the water and watch the blood go down the drain and pretend that you've just survived a gang battle and it's a really dramatic time for you? Um, no. What if, instead of a face, I just had a bowl of freshly steamed vegetables? Where? Oh, what? Oh no. Sleep. Just go to sleep. Please! How weird would it be if we talk from our butts? Jesus, have you watched Ace Ventura? And um, this is personally one of my favourites. Okay, today I learned that apparently the penis has a say in whether or not a child will be a boy or a girl. Female sperm will swim slower than the male sperm, but the male can't swim for as long as the females. This means that the pen that this means that a long penis will be closer to the egg when releasing the sperm. And there will be a higher chance for the child to be a boy. So in conclusion, if you have a lot of sons, you have a big dick. And they've got this picture. I just ruined Harry Potter for myself. Brilliant. Oh, Arthur. I do not make this better for myself. Okay, I'm done with this. Okay, I'm done with this site. Good night. So yeah, that was my little creepy reading of some deep thoughts of Tumblr users. Oh. Okay, so thanks for- So if you've seen Tumblr posts like these, put them in the comments and just tell me what they are because I'd like to have a good, good giggle at them. And, oh, before I forget, I sell t-shirts now and no, they're not for my channel because I'm not that bigoted yet. Um, that they are from the t Fault on Our Stars Live and this t-shirt that I made for that event so and people asked if I could make it and sell it so I said okay I'll go on Spreadshirt so links in the doobly-doo and I hope to see people wearing them or possibly buying them because just to know that my work's actually been worth it so check it out and um, if you like this video then subscribe and if you didn't like this video I'm sorry I'll work harder bye